Welcome back to yet another video for Class Radio, and today we'll be pushing a ladder with a Scream Musketeer deck. So with that being said, let's just kind of get started. But before we get started, let's just kind of analyze this deck a little bit. This deck may look familiar to some people, it's, it's a little bit different from the main going Scream Musketeer deck, but I kind of modified it for my need since um, the Mother Witch is just really good, and she just she provides excellent bait along with making all those piggies, which provide excellent support for the Stream Tears. And we also have Zap since the Barbarian Barrel kind of got hurt. You may remember the old deck which looks something like this deck. Uh, it used to have Barbarian Barrel along with Ghosts, but after those kind of got nerfed, I, I'm, not very, I'm not finding a very, pretty good place for them. So with that being said, I just kind of, you know, just replaced it with these troops and it's been doing pretty okay. Obviously, uh, it's, I've been a little bit higher. I'm down 200 trophies right now, but... Let's just kind of hop into the game, and I'm just gonna kind of show you how this deck works, and kind of show you how good it can be if I don't lose. So first things first, we're gonna try to get some pumps up, cause you know this is three musketeers, we need some pumps up. So let's we'll just kind of try to cycle to it. Uh, let me see. Yeah, you know what? He's not doing anything, so we got our pump and cycle. Thanks. Oh crap. Oh. Obviously we have to, you know, defend can't just let that get through or we could just take us out and damage it. that is okay oh, I don't really want to get that pump up man come on you're killing me man. hmm that's fine uh, there's no reason to rush pumps but still wouldn't hurt to get one up his swarm troops are gone oh that's that's fun <laughs> also, another good thing about mother which is she just kind of claps graveyard Unlike the last deck, which kind of, you know, got destroyed by it. But, yeah, we got a pretty good pressure going on. We'll, we'll zap his Garmin when it comes by. Okay. There it is. It is gone, and let's see what these LHs can do. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh, that's a lot of damage. So, what this deck, what you want to kind of do is kind of try to wait until three uh, double elixir hits. But in this guy's case, he kind of gave me the it gave me a good opening, which allowed me to take a tower and single elixir. And giant. Okay. Four. This is an interesting deck. This deck does have some problems that the last one didn't. For example, it is not as good against a hog cycle or that royal hogs deck with earthquake. Most of you guys know what I'm talking about. Um but yeah. Let me just defend this really quick. Mother of Witch is really good at just making piggies. It's amazing. Look at all these piggies. Four piggies. Thanks, Mother of Witch. Probably gonna scar me my witch. But as you see, double elixir just hit, and we do have a pump up. And this guy doesn't have a pump counter. That's probably the only reason I got a pump up. He does have graveyard, but oh gosh, his tower is low. Um, we'll just kind of elite. Get tank buster. Mother Witch, I am sorry for sacrificing you into the bowler. Yep, we're just gonna defend this push and call it good. Oh, we got two musketeers alive. It'd be nice if we can heal that. We just double heal spirit. Zero. Yes, look at that. The musketeers are back. Mirror is so toxic. It's just like the level 16 mirror. It's just. A level 16 cards. It's just amazing. It's just. Oh, there's a bunch of interacting differences that would not happen with just one level up. But as you see, there's a little example of the deck. We're going to hop into another battle after that. But yeah, the deck is doing pretty well for me. I mean, I am a little bit low right now, but other than that, the deck is doing pretty well. We'll just jump into another battle and just kind of do see if we can win another one. If we can't, that's totally fine, but you know, it is what it is. And as I said before, we're just going to try to cycle the pump. I hope he has fireball and just takes out the witch. Or you know the witch just makes a bunch of piggies. That's cool too. Looks like some sort of bait deck. I would like to protect that witch if I could. Golden Knight connects to the tower. Okay, that was pretty good. Just his dash jump. Uh, please don't try to dash with that. He's gonna try, oh. Oh yeah, that's fine. There we go. That's cool. I don't really like... Oh, gosh. I don't like doing this. I hope he doesn't have Swarm. 
I might, maybe I should just tank, no, I shouldn't have tanked it. It's fine. He has to rescue. Don't worry, the elites are just, just do as much damage as you can. You don't have to, you, have, you don't have to win the game or anything. It's fine. Take care of those two, and then I'll just zap this bad boy. Zap. Ooh. I would like to get a pump up, but this guy keeps pushing at me. So we'll just kind of wait for a good moment. Yes. Okay, I think this might be an appropriate time to get pump. I would assume he has a rocket, but there's a small chance he doesn't. Okay, I did not see that coming. And I was about to mirror pump, but we have to remember he has mirror... No, okay. no he doesn't. But we have to remember he has mirror too. But... There we go, we got a successful pump going on. Okay, he's gonna try to rush. Dang it. That's not good. We're probably gonna lose this tower. There's nothing wrong with that. But since we know he has, you know, Earthquake instead of an actual spell, this might work. I'll push with that Golden Knight. Get some shit damage. Might have double zapped that, but that would be a shame. Um, Mother Witch does provide excellent support. So, Mother Witch, do your magic. Oh, he did not pay attention. The left side is going to just go ham on his tower. So yeah, I should have specified- uh, oh crap, I don't want those to melt. There we go. Get that out. Get a tower. He doesn't have an actual spell. But uh, what I was going to say was three musketeers, um, it depends on you split pushing. There are some uh, circumstances where you don't want to split push. But what our main purpose is to try to overwhelm both sides and kind of, you know... Please stop hurting my tower. We want to just overwhelm both sides so they can't defend both sides and hope that one, at least one push gets through. It's possible for both pushes to get through, but Blitzkrieg Musketeers, you know, it just depends on what they give you. Most times you would want to sit back, kind of defend first, and then go on a counter push and take them out. But there are some circumstances where you would rather go offensive. For example, if they place gold in the back, you might want to just kind of rush them. Not with Blitzkrieg Musketeers, obviously, that's what the rush cards are for. If that makes any sense, but if you guys want to see more Three Musketeer videos, I will be glad to post more videos like this on a, you know, pretty constant rate. So, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, do consider subscribing. And if you like this video and enjoy Three Musketeer video, as, and if you like this video, sorry, I should have not messed up. But if you like this video and enjoy Three Musketeer content, make sure to leave a like. And as I said, if you're new here, consider subscribing. And we'll. We'll just make more videos like these and see if anyone likes them. So thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye.